Hey Rutgers, this is Jason Shark and I'm outside Trey's Hall in the Douglas Campus Center. We're going to be taking a look inside where the future scientists of America are getting their hands-on experience along with Rutgers undergrads at 12 science stations. Let's go inside and take a look. The Douglas Project has teamed up with local New Brunswick elementary schools to create their own science center for the students. This is actually our second year doing this and we are slowly and steadily growing so what we're hoping to actually do is incorporate this into almost a year-long program um, so we're in the midst right now trying to get funding from different grant programs uh, a lot of local pharmaceutical companies we're trying to get them to fund us and we want to expand right now we're only working in New Brunswick public schools and we're only working with four of them or three or four of them so we're hoping now to really expand and get every fourth grader in New Brunswick public schools to come here to Douglas campus and do this activity and after that we can go Middlesex County and then maybe New Jersey and we want to make it a, a huge huge thing. Yeah, last year we came here and we also went to the uh, Bronx Zoo as a couple of our trips and they actually enjoyed this more because they were you know when they got to the zoo they were you know they got they got around and they saw some animals but I think the participation with the college students, you know, it's a, it's a nice breath of fresh air for them. You know, they're going around, and they, even though they're older than our students, it's for them, they're like, wait a minute, this is a younger person. And the interaction that they see, I think, is, is what really clinches the deal here. After speaking with several teachers, volunteers, and Douglas College students, we found out that they enjoy this just as much as the fourth graders do. I mean, I get to watch all of our undergraduates here at Douglas Residential College shine and be leaders. So one of the, the key components of being a Douglas Residential College student is leadership. And I'm just so amazed and impressed with watching these women and how they just take charge and the children are so engaged. So it's kind of twofold. Our, our college students, they get to be leaders and get a chance to see what it's like to influence younger people. And the fourth graders get to come and they get to envision themselves and think, wow, you know, I really could be at college someday. I know the, the, one, the one station the kids were most impressed with so far was the one with the hand washing because the kids could see that they're really not clean their hands properly. As much as you tell them, scrub them, they don't. And they could see through the hands-on approach that there were germs still available on the hands. I just love to see them get excited about the science. Um, I was at the hand washing station and just helping them see like all the germs all over their hands, them getting excited about science, that's the best part. On a given day in science, I'll have maybe one or two centers sort of like this. But for them to be in 12, all of them are fun, going through, you know, they're eating stuff, looking through microscopes, taking their pulse. That's uh, a lot of good stuff. I can actually contact anybody in our office over at the Douglas Project, or you can go onto our website at Douglas Project, and there's a lot of information there for our pre-college programs. Our contact information is listed on there as well. What a day at the science fair. I know I learned a lot such as facts about the human anatomy, the five senses, and how to use a microscope. I hope these fourth graders have taken away as much as I have. For RUTV, I'm Jason Shark.